Hello students, in this lecture we will find the quantity of external plaster. In the last lecture we had found the quantity of internal plaster. Let us start calculating the quantity of external plaster using structure plan. Here we have the layout plan of ground floor. Its ceiling height is 4572 mm and the given thickness of the slab is 125 mm. For total height, we will have to add the thickness of the slab to ceiling height. The length of external walls of backside is 12802 and it will be the same on front side. Its number is 2, its length is 12802 and its depth is 4572 which is ceiling height plus 125 mm slab thickness which is equal to 4697. We will find its quantity by multiplying its number, length and depth. We convert it to meter square by dividing it with 1000 square. The length of the left hand side is 24765 and it will be the same in the right hand side. We will find its quantity in the similar way we found the above quantity. The edge faces of the column got left out and so we will calculate the area of all the edge faces of the column. Its length is 381 and we have 15 such faces in the left hand side which makes it 30 such faces with both LHS and RHS combined. Its number is 30, length is 381 and depth is same as above. We will find its quantity in similar way we found the above quantity. We will find the total quantity by adding all the quantities. Now let us calculate the deductions part. So here we have the joint details and we will take these details to the table. We will find its quantity by multiplying its number, length and depth. Do convert its quantity to square meter by dividing it with 1000 square. We will add the total deductions. Therefore, the actual plaster work to be done is equal to total plaster work A minus total deductions B. In this lecture, we learned to calculate the quantity of external plaster work.